welcome back to the weekly edition of JAG TV. Evan and I are excited to be back in these comfy chairs. How are you doing, Cyrus? I'm doing great, and I love those Among Us PJs. <laughs> Let's tackle this week in the jungle. You know who else is doing great? Mr. Abel's class with these amazing fire fan arts. Oh, wow. That is beautiful. It's amazing. Hey, Cyrus, how'd the Tolo go? The ER Tolo went great, and from what I've seen, it looked like an awesome time. Unfortunately, I could not make it, but I'm sure it was amazing, and you know, yeah. All the neon looked really fun, and the lights made everybody so bright. Next up, we've got our JAG Athletics. Let's cut to an interview in our sports department. What's your name and what position do you play? My name is Ian Edgecombe and I play defense on the soccer team. Uh, my first question is, what's the atmosphere like within the soccer team? Um, I said we have a pretty good energy. Uh, we all get along with each other and that helps with practice, trying to push through and really get ready for our game. Uh, yeah, my name is Mr. Morrison and I am the JV head coach and varsity boys assistant coach for the men's soccer team at Emerald Ridge. Uh, my first question is, what's the atmosphere like within the soccer team? Um, yeah, I would generally say it's pretty, pretty uh, good atmosphere. Most of the kids seem to get along, so it makes uh, training fun, and uh, kids are there to have a good time, which makes it enjoyable, but also there to work and, and get better. What's something that keeps you and your team motivated? Um, something that keeps me motivated, personally. I would say is when everyone else is working, they're doing the hardest and working their best. But I would say what keeps the team motivated and like all of us as together is when our coach is like, when our coach is motivated or our captains are motivated, we're there. And that's how we get, like the whole team gets set up and we're ready to go. So you just gotta have a good warm up. Uh, what's an event or match you're looking for this year? Uh, every year I look forward to the Puyallup match. They're historically a pretty good program, and uh, it's fun beating your crosstown rivals. So that's, a, that's always a big one that gets circled on our calendar every year. What's one of the strengths you think your team has over the other teams? Uh, we're pretty senior heavy, so we have a ton of experience, which is great. And then uh, offensively, we're a powerhouse. We've, our front uh, seven, are, I would put them up against probably anybody in the state. And so that'll, that's a big strength for us this year. Our Jags had a track meet on Wednesday against GK, and they did really well. The freshies and sophomores track invite was also last weekend from 9 a.m. to 1 p.m., and the underclassmen were definitely locked in. Baseball had three games last week against Bethel, Curtis, and Puyallup. Bikes down. <laughs> Softball also had games last week against South Kitsap and Rogers. Girls tennis had matches. Spring season is already going well, and I can't wait to see how it goes for our Jags. A quick update on scores over the weekend. Here is your weekend update. Last Thursday, the sophomore girls won, team champ won the track team championship by a single point at the track meet. Nick Altheimer won first place in 300 hurdles. Jaciana Jaraholt secured four meet records. This Thursday, track is going to Bethel High School if you want to show up and support your drags. This Friday, we have a spring assembly and a performing arts showcase at 7 p.m. We also have a final message for the SAT takers. I hope it went really well. Hope no one cheated on it because that would be bad. Yeah. I hope you all got high scores and got exactly what you wanted. Anyways. It seems like that's all we have for this week in the jungle. No, wait, Cyrus. Can Ridgecast do this? Boom. What do you think of that? Wow. Nice. Ridgecast can't do that, right? <laughs> There's no way. Anyways, thank you for turning, tuning in this week's episode. I'm glad we could have you all. I'm glad I'm back. And yeah. Anyways, this has been... Jag TV signing, signing out. out.